Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Taurus for the month of March. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for March 2020. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. Right after this reading, the next reading I'm going to do is where are you going to be in six months? So I'm going to do a Taurus reading for six months from now. That ought to be interesting, huh? So, and then I'm going to do it for each of the 12 signs. For those of you cross-watching, yes, yours is going to come. I don't do them in any particular order. And I don't leave anybody out. I get some people that comment, Oh, you left out Aquarius. Bull. You didn't look hard enough. So, I don't leave anybody out. But anyway, it will get done. So, right now, we're going to do Taurus March 2020. And then we're going to do Taurus... We're going to be in six months from now. So stay tuned. What do we have for Taurus for March 2020? Now, did I say 2016? Because I, I've wanted to say 2016. So I don't know where 2016 is coming from. Where were you in 2016? Not in a very good place for me. I don't know about you. But if you think back to 2016, that is when my life started to fall apart. So I don't know about yours. I happen to be Taurus, son. Um, so, I, I, yeah. Hmm. 2016. The truth. Judgment. Judgment. Yay. So this is judgment. Somebody may want you to give them another chance. Okay. This is forgiveness, this is release, this is acceptance. So in March, somebody could be asking for forgiveness. This is also, are you ready to be judged? This is some sort of truth being revealed in March. Somebody being held accountable, taking accountability. Responsibilities being assigned, but this is also the end of things. It's acceptance and absolution and forgiveness. This is an awakening. Somebody is going through some sort of awakening or they're getting a wake-up call or they've had a wake-up call. This is also a card of karma. Will you be accepted? Somebody may be coming to you with the truth and asking for forgiveness. Something to do with the 20th. I don't know what... My birthday happens to be on the 20th, which is interesting. But anyway, I'm not sure what something about this 20. This is the judgment card. This is the card of karma. And there is going to be some sort of truth that is revealed to you this month. Hallelujah. What could it be? Somebody may want a reconciliation or forgiveness. Because the judgment card, if you think about judgment day, what's judgment? Judgment is about forgiveness. So, hmm, somebody may be asking for forgiveness. Judgment is also a life-changing decision. It's where you make a judgment call. So you're probably going to be needing to make a judgment call this month. Okay. Hmm. What is this about? What do we have for Taurus for the month of March? Choose love. You always have a choice as to what you should do. And you are definitely going to be making a judgment call this month. Oh boy, isn't that just grand? So yeah, something on this card. I don't know what. Anyhow, choose love. Choose love. You have a choice as to what you should do. You're going to be making a choice this month about love. You probably have to choose between two. That could be the case or whether you want to forgive somebody or not. That really bothers me. Anyway, yeah, so I think that you're definitely going to be making a difficult choice. That's just great, huh? Maybe you choose to love yourself, you know? Somebody may want a renewal with the judgment card, you know? They may, may want another chance. Maybe you want another chance. Could go either way. Somebody wants another chance. Here we go. We got one three of wands. Hmm. Now this is get prepared. Get prepared for... Uh, well, something's about to get lit up by the looks of things. Yep. Gonna get hot. It is gonna get hot. You're waiting for the moment. It's about to get lit up. So shit is about to get lit up there, Taurus. Oh boy, seven of wands. Look at that. This is chopping wood, getting ready. We got somebody here that is getting ready. 
<laughs> they're getting ready to light the fire. They're getting ready to give you some attention. They're getting ready to communicate. They're getting ready to show you something. They gotta show you what they can do. You got somebody that is getting prepared right now. They're getting ready. They are going, they want to be on top. They're going to fight against the competition. They want to, this is like a competition. It's like they're going to put themselves in the competition here. Somebody's going to be competing. They're going to be competing. We have a competition that is coming here. And we have somebody also that is overwhelmed. They, if you think about seven plus three wands, ten of wands, this is overwhelmed. Somebody, I think we have somebody that's going to try to prove themselves to you. I don't know who this person is. Could be a fire sign. Aries of the old Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. Could be a Scorpio. Um, could be a, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. King of Swords. We have somebody. He's been investigating. Hasn't spoken up yet. So we have somebody that has been investigating. They have not communicated. They're thinking about it. They're going to make a very practical approach. Okay, this guy is logical. He thinks before he acts. Okay, so we have somebody here that is is planning. This guy is planning. He's he's got his eyes on the prize by the looks of things, and he's he was gonna win it. So he's making a plan. He really is. It's like he's got the he's gonna communicate, but he hasn't yet. He's definitely thinking about it. This person is a professional. This person may come across as cold, but um, they're not the type to. Uh, tell you to flatter you with nonsense. This person doesn't flatter you with nonsense. This person speaks fluent truth, okay? Speaks fluently, f speaks honestly, and speaks very bluntly. This is somebody who uh, takes time to decide what they're going to do, and when they do communicate, you know, you can bet that they've thought about it. It wasn't no spur of the moment thing this guy has thought about what he is going to do what he's going to say how he's going to prove himself what he wants he's very uh, smart and he investigates does not act stupidly um three of cups socialize socializing celebrating having fun Justice. You may be dealing with a Libra, but it looks as though we have some sort of decision that is definitely about to be made. We definitely have some karma here as well. We have a karmic situation here. There's no doubt about it. Somebody is going to be stepping forward and speaking something to you, and it is going to be very honest, okay? They're going to say something to you that is very truthful, it's very honest, it's very direct, It's like they want to be part of this competition. They do want to be part of it. They want to prove themselves to you. They are going to be very honest. Somebody's going to come to you with the truth. Somebody's going to be speaking the truth. They may have gotten themselves engaged with somebody that wasn't well suited for them. Because this is not somebody that's not well suited. They may have met somebody on, on a dating site or on social media or something, but it didn't work out. This is this is like uh, somebody that's not well suited. Somebody that is very, um, well, maybe it's promiscuous. You know, just it doesn't settle down very much. Uh, is very flighty, very. Um, pessimistic, uh, negative Nelly, just negative for them, not on the same page. Let me focus this in a little bit better. So we have somebody here that is, is definitely thinking right now. They're thinking about what they have to do to prove themselves. They are definitely have their eye on you. They are wanting some sort of chance and they know that they're going to, that they have to come and speak with you. Um, but they may be thinking negatively. But a decision is going to be made. Somebody is going to act in a very truthful manner. Okay, there's a lot of truth coming out this month. Get prepared to hear some 
some direct communication from somebody that is very truthful. I know I've repeated myself, but it looks like this person <coughs> may want to take you out, may want to socialize, may want to may want to have some drinks with you or something like that. It's like they're going to communicate with you and they may want to take you out to a party or something like that. Ooh, they see you as wish fulfillment. They do. And it's almost like they want to come help you as well. They see that you're shining, they see that you're a star, they see that you're 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 glowing. They feel as though you are what they asked for. So somebody is definitely hoping that they can win you over. <clears throat> yep. Interesting. Now the star is beauty. The star is a wish being. Somebody sees you as their wish. And this is unexpected help. Taurus, somebody, and it could be an Aquarius. could be an Aquarius. could be a Libra. <clears throat> it's like unexpected help is arriving. This person is a worker. This person is a professional. This person is smart and intelligent. This person may be a firefighter. I don't know if it is a firefighter. Maybe. May or may not be. This person... Uh, builds or you may this person may build things seven of cups now beware of false beginnings right this is you're probably going to be confused you're probably going to be unsure you're you're going to be presented with a choice obviously we can see that you're going to be presented with a choice and you're going to have to choose wisely. I mean, you don't want to choose a snake. I mean, there's definitely a snake here. The snake is very clear. Okay, you see the snake right there? You're probably going to be present. You are going to be presented with a choice. Choose wisely. Choose wisely. So, yeah, you're going to be in a state of confusion. You're going to have to choose between two, two people this month. Or two paths. Two. Two of Pentacles. I knew it, too. You definitely have to choose between two this month. Two paths. Uh, some, you can't have both. I mean, the Two of Pentacles reversed is, is lacking balance. It's lacking organization. Making a poor decision. Biting off more than you can chew. chew too many balls in the air. Uh, you weren't planning for this. Now, now there's chaos. Now there's, it's like you don't know what to do. It's confu You're definitely going to be in a state of confusion this month. It's like somebody has made a decision to come forward with. It's like how they truly feel. And you probably are going to be like. <sighs> It feels like you, and now you have to choose. Do you do you want to be single, or do you want to go with this person, or do you, or maybe you're with somebody new, and you know. Now this person wants to be part of it, so I think that you're gonna be you're definitely gonna be in a state of confusion. Um, five of Wands, competition, comp. We have a big competition here. We do have a competition. Somebody is going to be competing for your attention. Um, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Be careful. Be really careful. Get prepared. Get prepared to make a very difficult choice. You're going to have to choose between two. One of them may be King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Th it doesn't have to be. This doesn't have to be a Capricorn. This could be any person that does things illegally. Okay, this person may sell drugs on the side. This person um, does things illegally to obtain money, isn't really stable, isn't really secure. Maybe they have money, but they're really, really greedy. This person is selfish. They have a really big ego. So you, you, you're going to have a choice between somebody that 
is probably boastful and loud and obnoxious and um, money hungry or doesn't make money or just is very shallow and, you know, selfish. Or you're going to have a choice between somebody who, you know, is quiet and um, <sighs> totally different. We got two totally different people here. This person is boastful, um, arrogant. This person is quiet. This person is reserved. This person um, seems cold because they're vi very direct, but they're direct in a quiet way. This person is boastful. This person, so you got a choice between two people. You got one person that is very arrogant and egotistical, and maybe a little bit more fun than this person. Okay, this person is, you know, does things that are against the law, which can be appealing and risky. Okay, not that, not that I'm saying that it is, but I'm just saying this person is different. This person wastes money, just does things stupid. All about show. This person is more about show. This person is quiet, uh, reserved, uh, logical, um, seems standoffish but is more real than this person is this person seems real they have a lot of nice things but they're that's all it is it's just things this person is not emotionally available all they're interested in is money and things and their job and what it looks like to society so you're definitely going to have to make a decision this month. Yep, 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 yep. You're going to be making a decision this month. And you are being called to choose love. Choose love. Don't choose things. You are going to be making a choice. Probably between, you know, somebody that you have a karmic past with and somebody new. It's like you've already overcome the challenge of this person. Why would you want to do it again? But I feel like we have somebody here that is is going to come forward with the truth, and they're but they're what they say to you is the truth. Um, but you need to be careful with with yeah. They're going to tell you the truth, but I don't think they've changed. I don't think they've changed. I don't. If they have changed, you know, they're really going to have to prove it. So, um, for some, for some of you, it's like a definite wish is being granted with the star card. A wish is being granted. You're going to be shining. You are going to be shining. You are the star of the show this month. And somebody is going to put themselves in the competition. They are going to fight for you. And that is what I have. So we are going to do a six month look ahead. Just for where are you going to be in six months from now? So also, before I close, before I say goodbye, this, this justice, and this is, this is like justice as well. And this is you getting what you deserve. You asked for somebody you asked you asked for this you you asked for justice you asked for something here it is choose wisely you don't want to repeat your same mistakes so yeah anyway that's what i have good luck you have a choice between two follow your heart And protect your heart. If somebody involved you in a third party situation before. Don't think they're going to change. They'll do it again when they don't get their way. This person that involved you in a third party may have experienced some karma. And now they want to come back. It doesn't work like that. You have somebody here that is noble and true. 
do not give your heart away to somebody who broke it in the past. Perhaps this is the time that you make your final decision. Your final choice. If this person doesn't show up, perhaps it's the time where you accept and you release. Because this is a, the judgment is about acceptance and release. It's also a reconciliation. Somebody wants a reconciliation. And this could be somebody from a past life. We could have a past life connection here. With somebody new. One of these people is not well suited for you. Beware. Beware of false beginnings. One of these people is a snake. Look below the surface. Good luck.